What is up everybody, in today's video I'm really excited to be showing you how you can get a free Game Boy Advance uh, hack on both Android and iOS devices guys as you can see this emulator is installed on my iOS device guys basically all you have to do is open up the app and download any Game Boy Advance game for absolutely free guys in the store and you can go ahead and run any Game Boy Advance uh, the game on both Android and iOS devices now this is by far the only GBA or Game Boy Advance emulator that actually works that I have found out about guys it's basically on this really cool website that I will make sure to show you later on in the video just all you have to do guys in today's video is watch this uh, until the end because the process is uh, first off very simple and very easy to do it will take you a few minutes at max and another thing that i need to mention is that this uh, tutorial has some very important steps you guys cannot miss out on i highly recommend you watch this video until the end because uh, i will be mentioning some very key details that you guys have to do in order to get this emulator working on your phone so guys without further ado let me get straight into the video into the tutorial and show you guys how to install it all right so, so guys as you can see right here i will be showing you this on my iphone 7 because i do not have an android currently with me now fear not that uh, as i said before this will work on both android and ios devices i'll make sure to point out the differences between those two devices as we go along but for now just stick with me and follow the ios version so as you can see right here guys i have the gba emulator on now i won't be opening it up because it takes a while for it to open up it will take a lot a while to load because i have a very weak phone but guys don't worry this will work on your phone for absolutely free and by far the only working gba emulator for mobile devices so let me go ahead and show you guys what you need to do to get this working on android and ios for ios guys go ahead and open up your settings and in settings all you have to do guys is scroll down until you find battery and battery go ahead and click on it and right here all you have to do is make sure that low power mode has been turned off so right here once this little battery icon is black and out yellow that's how you know for 100 certainty that low power mode has been disabled and you should be good to go to the next step right here so the next step guys is going back to your settings scroll it up until you find general click on back on app refresh guys uh, guys click on it once more and right here all you have to do is enable either wi-fi or Wi-Fi and mobile data. Now it really does not matter which one of these two you decide to turn on. Could be Wi-Fi, could be Wi-Fi and mobile data. For you, this may be even Wi-Fi and cellular data. Again, guys, it really does not matter. Just make sure that either Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi and mobile data is turned on. Now the next step is checking that your software version is above 11. Now the way that you do that, guys, is by going into your general then click on about right here and you can see the second tab right here is software version so as you can see mine is 15.7.5 meaning it's above 11 so i'm good to go now if your software version is 11 exactly or below 11 make sure you update your software version to the latest one and you should be good to go to the next step now the last step guys for android and ios users alike go ahead and open up the browser that you guys have installed and in the search bar enter app stove dot com everybody that is a site that you guys want to be going on that's appstore.com click on next and it's going to take you to this wonderful site basically what this site is it's a tweak site that allows you to have a bunch of cool modded versions of games and applications for free for now we're only interested in gba emulator right here go ahead and click on install guys and basically all you have to do for this to work is go ahead and click on download now as soon as you click on download guys instructions will appear and all you have to do from that point onwards is read and follow exactly what the instructions say and do them obviously now once you do the instructions very carefully go ahead and restart your device and the gpa emulator will start automatically downloading that is all for today's video guys if you enjoyed it don't forget to like and subscribe share this to all of your friends so you can go ahead and play gba games for free and i'll catch you guys in the next one